And I give you this ring. And I give you this ring. As a symbol of our marriage. As a symbol of our marriage. And as a token of our love. And as a token of our love. Simon, I give you this ring as a symbol of our marriage, as a symbol of our marriage, and as a token of our love, and as a token of our love. And now, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to invite Sam forward, who has our reading for us. I love you, not for what you are, but for what I am when I am with you. I love you not only for what you have made of yourself, but of what you are making of me. I love you for the part of me that you bring out. That you, uh, sorry, I love you for putting your hand into my heat of heart and passing over all the foolish, weak things that, can't, that you can't help dimly seeing there. And for drawing out into the light all the beautiful belongings that no one else had looked quite far enough to find. I love you because you have done more than any other could to make me good and more than any other fate could have done to make me happy. You have done it without a touch, without a word, without a sign. You have done it by being yourself. And so, family and friends of Simon and Emma, through the vows that they have made here today, they are pledging themselves to each other for the years ahead, believing that whatever life may have in store for them, they will share through the strength that their marriage will bring. Simon and Emma, you have now made your declarations of marriage as prescribed by law, and through them have made a solemn and binding contract with each other in the presence of the registrar, but possibly more importantly in the presence of both. So it therefore gives me the greatest of pleasures to announce you are now lawfully joined together as husband and wife. And Simon, if you'd like to seal your marriage in the traditional way, and kiss your bride. Congratulations.